Hello and welcome. This video is going to show you how to use the expanded column method for addition. This written method is usually used in year 3. So imagine I wanted to do the sum 360 plus 9. Using my knowledge of place value, I'm going to put some place value headings down and then I'm going to place my first number underneath my place value headings and my second number under my place value headings. I'm going to draw a line underneath because this is from now on where my workings out are going to be. The first thing to do is I'm going to find out how many ones I've got. So in this row here over on the right hand side I'm going to put that I have zero ones inside some brackets plus nine ones and then the answer to that particular sum goes in the same row so I'm going to write a nine in that row and it also goes in the ones column because I'm adding up the ones. I'm now going to do the same for my tens column I'm going to put some brackets on the next row down, I have six tens or sixty, and I want to add that to. Oh, well, I've got nothing in my tens column here, so I'm adding no more tens. So the answer to sixty plus zero goes in this row. I have six tens and no ones because the answer was sixty. I've now got to add my hundreds together. So I'm now going down onto the third row. I've got three hundreds plus, oh, again, I've got no more hundreds, so I'm going to put a zero. So I now need to add together 300 plus zero, which is 300. So my answer goes in the same row as my brackets. So the three goes in the hundreds column, zero and zero. All I have to do now to find out the answer is to add up my columns. So in my ones column I've got a 9, in my tens column I've got a 6, and in my hundreds column I've got a 3. So the answer is 369. 